The wonderful thing about additive manufacturing is, is it's an extremely data rich technology. And for most people, there's so much data that it becomes overwhelming and you can't interpret that data. So what we set out to do here at the MDF was to help create tools that actually help users understand that data, use that data, interpret that data, and can convert then actual data into certification qualification for an end use part. We're working with uh, additive manufacturing researchers, uh, taking their log files that are produced by the 3D printers that are uh, developed in these large objects. Um, and we're looking at the log data to try to help them understand what's going on in the 3D printing process, help them uh, identify defects and uh, understand why uh, the object was, uh, um, had the defect in the uh, print process and we're using visualization tools to do that. The visualization tools enabled the, uh, the researcher to visualize patterns and trends in the data that would be otherwise invisible in large tables or large log files that they would look at. I think everybody in additive knows that we can build almost any geometry now. That isn't the hard part. The hard part is taking that part and understanding how it's going to behave when you put it into service. And so for us at the MDF, we have come up with a lot of methods to do that well. Um, what we are trying to do is create the tools that help industry also do that well.